and uh, you're right on time for news weekend at one let's begin with matters health and we have to get to know what the world health organization is saying about covid 19 and the who chief uh, um, uh, that is tedros dahum uh, dahum has uh, sounded a warning on the Treat, on the threat actually COVID-19 continues to pose on a global scale. Consequently, the World Health Organization has made a call on all countries to strengthen surveillance, sequencing and reporting so as to assess the risk of new variants uh, such as EG5 and BA2.86. Uh, While briefing journalists in Geneva, Tedros Adhanom, um, who is direct, WHO's director, underscored that although data available to WHO continues to decline, there has been a marked increase in reports of hospitalizations, ICU admissions and deaths in some countries. COVID remains a global health threat. Although data available to WHO continues to decline, we have seen increasing reports of hospitalizations, ICU admissions and deaths in some countries. We continue to call on all countries to strengthen surveillance, sequencing and reporting so we can assess the risk of new variants such as EG.5 and BA.2.886. Out of 234 countries and territories, WHO has data on cases in 103 of those. That does not mean that the virus is not circulating in a number of countries that, have not, that are not reporting. We only have data on hospitalizations from 19 countries and territories. We have data from 17 countries on ICU, and we have countries, uh, we have data on deaths from 54 countries. And this is out of 234 countries and territories. Your likelihood of developing severe disease and dying is reduced with vaccines. Um, the many safe and effective vaccines that are in um, circulation, that are in use right now, um, early access to clinical care, antivirals, reduces the risk of developing severe disease. Um, so that's what is important for, a general, uh, for the general public in, in our view. We will give a full profile and do a risk assessment of BA.2.86 um, as soon as we have more information. Um, we expect the number of cases um, to be increased because we classified it as a variant under monitoring. Right, so that is what WHO has to say.